Hey, this is your Olympic hero, Kurt Angle, reminding you to subscribe to The Game MLL for the best video game character remakes and wrestling games on Xbox and PlayStation. Oh, it's true. It's damn true. Subscribe now. It's Friday night, and you know what that means. It's time for another episode of Friday Night Freddy's. Now, I was away last week. I was enjoying myself. Much needed little vacation in Mexico. So we didn't have content for a couple weeks. My apologies. I'm getting back into the swing of things, though, this week. We're going to pick up exactly where we left off, and that's going to be with Nightmare taking on Clown Springtrap. Now, if you missed it, on the last episode of Friday Night Freddy's, Nightmare went the distance in the Freddy Fazbear face-off. We had different versions of Fredbear, Freddy, all the Freds going head-to-head, -head, and Nightmare came out victorious. At the very end of the match, I revealed there was going to be a surprise challenger, and the challenger to reveal himself was Clown Springtrap. So, uh, big shout out to Spring Fox for making this version of Nightmare. You can find him on the community using the hashtag FNAF. Same with Clown Springtrap. I'm not really sure who made that. You guys want to claim him in the comments? Uh, maybe you guys already know who did. But uh, yeah, I'll leave you a shout out if you made the Clown Springtrap that's featured in today's video. Anyways, a uh, big shout out to Nitro Glitch for letting me use his beat for this song. It's called Was It Me? Was It Me? Alright. So, hope you guys had a awesome week. Let me know what you guys did in the comments. If you guys did anything cool, let me know. All right, and his opponent making his official debut. Please welcome Clown Springtrap. <laughs> All right, this will be the first time he's featured in a singles contest, let alone any contest for that matter. Made a little cameo appearance last time we had an episode. So let me explain the nature of this match. It will be a timed match. Whoever can put their opponent through the most tables will be declared the winner. The iron table match. I think last time I saw one of these is probably Enter versus Nightmare. Alright, Clown Springtrap is here. He looks geared up for competition. Let's head down to the ring. We have ref Fred Fazbear about to kick things off for us. Alright, let's get this thing started. Nightmare ran into a combo right out of the gate. Clown Springtrap, a little flurry of offense. Man, Clown Springtrap is much larger than I imagined. All right, Nightmare gets sent into the turnbuckles. Big chop to the face. And I thought he was going for a powerbomb. Wrenching the neck of Nightmare. Nightmare's firing back. Oh, overhead. Right to the face. Springtrap getting to his feet here. Nightmare comes off the top ropes, elbow to the dome. Clown Springtrap shook that off. Man, he's running into those hammer blows. Aren't gonna be uh, standing too much longer after taking some of those shots, am I right, guys? Boom, big time choke slam by Nightmare. Clown Springtrap rolls out of the ring. Nightmare is capitalizing, looking for some tables, trying to score some points in this tables match. Fans are excited for tables. I'm excited for tables. Who, who doesn't love tables if you're a wrestling fan? Oh, and he 
got launched on the back of his neck. Right on the other side of the table. Those metal bars are unforgiving. Nightmare. Oh, it looked like he was about to set up the table. Springtrap scores with the drop kick. Nightmare gets sent into the corner. Oh, another German suplex. He returns fire. This time, Nightmare getting dumped on his head. Springtrap setting up a table. Oh, he mows him down. Looked like a modified the Luthez press. And Springtrap fires him into the corner. Oh, big time chop to the chest. Nightmare collapses. He have chopped him any harder. He might have chopped him through the table. Nightmare launches him in. He's getting a full head of steam. He's going to send him through the spear. Oh, no, he counters. Famous, sir. Boom, plants him face first right into the canvas. He's setting him up here. He's got him in a exploder. Launches Nightmare into the into the corner right through the table. That was the first point on the board, and that goes to Clown Springtrap. It is one to zero. He goes sailing over the top ropes. Nice springboard action gracefully for a larger athlete flying over the top ropes with ease. He has him scooped up. He's got him set up for the running Liger Bomb right on the floor. Knocking the wind out of Nightmare. And boom, he turns him around into a power slam right onto the cement. Rhymony. About 15 minutes left on the clock. It is one to zero with Clown Springtrap with the advantage in this Iron Man table match. Oh, wait a second guys, Spring, Springtrap didn't see it, but Nightmare got to his feet. Full head of steam, and he's capitalizing with those hammer blows. He knows that seems to be his weakness. Focusing in on the right side of the face. I should say uh, Springtrap's left side of his face, rather. And Nightmare's trying to set up something. He's got that table positioned. Looking for a modified sidewalk slam. Oh, through the table. Literally just sidewalk slammed him. It is now one to one. It's a whole new ball game. Boom, and another power bomb. This time he lands on the shards of the table. And Nightmare scoops him up into a fall away slam. Is that going to be enough to keep down Clown Springtrap? It doesn't matter for a three count. We're looking for victories by putting your opponent through a table. Nightmare has ascended. Oh, and he scores with a big time splash. He cleared half of the ring, guys. And Nightmare sets him up. Oh, wait a second, there's a table outside the ring. I didn't even see that. Boom! Over the top ropes. It is now two to zero. And Nightmare in firm control over this iron table match. Oh, wait, he got caught. Boom! Big time lariat from Clown Springtrap. He just got decapitated, Nightmare. Nightmare getting a bit overzealous. Throws him into the ring. A spring trap looking for here. He's got a ladder. Ladder coming into the fold. Whoa. Boom, and he dumps him with a inverted power slam. He just used all of Nightmare's weight to gain momentum on that offense. 
check to the face. Man, Nightmare's lucky he didn't get busted open. Nightmare just barely recovering here. Shrugs it off. And he DDTs him right into the ladder. He's just doing a number on Nightmare's spine with those inverted power slams. Nightmare trying to score any offense that he can to break out of the grasp of Clown Springtrap. Fred Fazbear getting a closer look at things, moving a little bit closer into the ring. Oh, and Nightmare runs him over with the body clothesline. Guys, it is 2-0, oh, excuse me, 2-1 to one right now. Nightmare again, pulling forward with another chokeslam through the table. It is now 3-1. to one. Dominant command from Nightmare. We have about roughly 10 minutes left of this match. And Nightmare is bringing out the punishment now. Oh, he runs, scores with a shot to the midsection. There's the butterfly suplex. And Nightmare looks like he's setting up something here. Clown Springtrap is starting to stir around a little bit outside the ring. Here he comes trying to get some offense. Oh, he mows him down again. These guys are just using their sheer size and momentum to gain any kind of offense that they can in this contest. Boom, and he careens him almost right into the ladder. Oh, he checked him with the table. Table for two, please. Again, these behemoths just colliding back and forth here. Looks like he's got the ladder. Well, I thought Freddy gained an extra 10 feet in his height, though. It was an interesting perspective there. Nightmare is setting up something crazy. He's ascending to the top of the ladder. Yo, if I'm Clown Springtrap, why would you just push the ladder over? Come on. He's getting up all disoriented. Think, does he think it's a ladder match? Oh, he wants to fight him at the top of the ladder. How about it? Oh, big time right cross. Is he going to shake it off? Boom, he uppercuts Nightmare. Uh-oh, he hooks the arm. Nightmare's seen enough. Boom, it is now. Four to one. Four to one. What a squash match. And Nightmare is looking for the nail in the coffin, the Nightmare Screwdriver. Man, Nightmare is hitting him with his best shots. I'm surprised that uh, Clown Springtrap isn't knocked out. Oh, he goes over the top ropes. Catches him with a Spaceman Plancha. I didn't see that coming. He's rolled back into the ring. Nightmare counters. It is a four to one contest. I don't know how Clown Springtrap is gonna try to come back in five minutes, but there's just a little over five minutes left of this contest. This Iron Man tables match. Oh, wait a second, the tables have turned here. Clown Springtrap rising up from the ashes. He's got him goozled. It is now two to four. Two to four. How about it? He's halfway there. Is this going to be an upset for Clown Springtrap to shut down Nightmare in his very first contest here on Friday Night Freddy's? He hits the ropes. Oh, the whoopee cushion. Clown Springtrap, what's he doing here? 
Moving the ladder. He's setting him up for something big here. Yo, he should have a table in position. I think he's just looking to incapacitate Nightmare. He's going to give him his best shot. Oh, there's a cutter off the ladder. Oh, my God. He didn't even sell it. He said, I don't think so. He comes back with a choke slam. I can't even believe what I'm seeing here, guys. How did he come back with a choke slam after taking that, that cutter on the ladder from the top ropes? Speaking of ladders, there's the Nightmare Screwdriver. Back of the head first into the ladder. Dangerous, dangerous spot there. Nightmare setting him up for round two. Oh, he just cracked him in the head with the ladder. That'll do. And what's Nightmare setting up here? Nightmare's doing something outside the ring. Springtrap is... Wait a second. Springtrap... Oh, I think he just caught wind of what he was trying to do. He counters. He just about shoved him through another table. If that would have shattered, it would have been three to four. It would have been three to four. Nightmare setting up the other table. And Springtrap now gets whipped into the buckles. I'm not sure what Nightmare has in store for Springtrap. He's trying to set up something with the tables outside the ring, it looks like. Oh, there's a baseball slide from Clown Springtrap. Oh, and he runs him over with a full head of steam. Nice clothesline. He's too battling back into the ring. Nightmare's looking for the end of dreams. Boom, face first into the ladder. And it looks like, looks like he's rolled over into those uh, tables that Nightmare had set up. What's Nightmare got in store for him here, guys? Oh, Clown Springtrap counters. He scoops him up. Oh, he power slams him through a table. It is now three to four. Three to four. We got two minutes left. Will Clown Springtrap be able to come back? He skips him up. One more time. Oh, another slam through the table. It is now a new ball game. It is now four to four. A minute 27 left on the clock. Oh my God, who's gonna win this contest? The next match that we do, guys, will be the boxy face-off. You guys wanna submit a creation for the foxy face-off? Upload a foxy using the hashtag FNAF or the game MLL. To let me know you want him in the video. But yeah, that'll be featured next Friday, so make sure you guys set your reminders. And it looks like Nightmare is setting up a table. Speaking of setting things up, he's got him on the top ropes. Oh, he goes over the top. We got 27 seconds, excuse me, 37 seconds left of this contest. Nightmare has control of the match, but I think he may have made a mistake there when uh, when Clown Springtrap fell out of the ring. We got 17 seconds left, guys. Five, four, three, two, one, zero. He didn't beat him. Yo, Clown Springtrap didn't win either. What is going on here, guys? We got a draw. We got a draw. Man, like and subscribe for next week's video.
You guys have an awesome day. SCU! Greetings and salutations. It's your man CD, the fallen angel, Christopher Daniels, former Ring of Honor world champion, current member of the AEW roster, one of the founders of SCU, and an all-around handsome man, and listen to what I have to tell you. If you're looking for the cool videos or the best video game character remakes, for Xbox and PlayStation, what you want to do is go to YouTube and check out the Game MLL channel. Subscribe to him, like him. He's the man with the master plan, and you're going to enjoy everything he does. So check him out and tell him the Fallen Angels sent you. SCU later.